In today's video, I am going to show you to find the spring constant of a helical spring by plotting a graph between load and extension. So, I have a Huxley apparatus uh, set up here. Uh, you can see a Huxley apparatus set up and the pointer, spring, stand and the scale. So, make sure at the beginning of your experiment, the pointer should be in a zero. And I do have a weight. I do have a weights here, so you can see a weights here. Uh, the weight here is 20 grams. So I have a 20 gram weights. So I'll show you the table and the reading, how to keep the readings in the table. So first, I would like to add 20 grams load in a spring and see the reading. After adding. So I added 20 grams here and I can see the readings here. So the reading shows 1.5 centimeters difference. So the elongation happened here is 1.5 centimeter. So let's add 20 more grams and it shows 3 centimeter which is really good. So the loading I am recording it into the table so you can see the table later. I will show you the table. I am recording it somewhere so I will show you the table. So the third 20 grams shows 4.5, a fourth 20 grams shows, now let's see it properly, 6 centimeter, I'm adding two more, fifth one shows, let's see the reading properly, it is 7.5 centimeter, and the last one shows mm, 9 centimeter. So these recordings are recorded in a loading part. Now similarly, the unloading parts will start recording it from the bottom level. You will see in the table, the last one readings remain the same for loading and unloading. Now I'm removing one and it goes to the unloading part. So it is 7.5. Six. Hold on. Four point five. It is three. One point five, and the last one I'm removing. It comes again to zero. So all the readings are shown in the table and the calculations is done. You can see in the table and the graph will be plotted for you. Thank you for watching.